What's going on? It's your boy Coach here, and we are at the end of the line for the X-Form series. As a matter of fact, today is my very last day. It's been quite the journey. I've learned a lot for sure. I've had a lot of fun doing this. It's been a ton of work, but at the end of the day, I'm really happy with how it came out, and it really isn't about, let's say, that popular view or something, you know, the whole goal of this was just lifestyle change and to better myself, and I think I've done that. I have my physique and picture stuff tomorrow because yesterday, unfortunately, had a lot of salt. I'm retaining a little bit of water today, so that's something where I want it to be consistent for the end. But ultimately, it's also another thing because I'm about to start the Q-Form series, and that's actually going to be my starting pictures. And that's about an eight-week journey into very hard, let's say, that's an eight-week journey that's going to be focused strictly on, say, body fat loss, weight loss, on a very aggressive scale. And there's a number of reasons why you would maybe want to do it. It's something I've done in the past. And there's like, there are some interesting things you can learn about yourself in that process, but it's really difficult. It's probably going to be the hardest, say, uh, to capture just because it's going to be um, very emotional, very difficult. It's going to be frustrating at times. Um, and that's actually kind of why I wanted to do it is to capture that in the process of how hard it is, you know, to try and make aggressive weight loss and lose a bunch of weight and how hard it is to keep that off. So um, we're going to be going through that. And I've, you know, kind of thought about a way to do it where it's more entertaining and I'm hoping that you really enjoy it. So that's at the end of the day, what I'm kind of hoping to do is just progress in this process, make the content a little more, say, exciting, make it a little more, um, draw you in a little bit trying to just make this a little bit better. That's really my overall goal is to make sure this comes out, you know, decent and that you can enjoy it and learn from it. So it's kind of where I'm trying to get that balance of learning, you know, the editing techniques and things. It's taken me a long time to do, learn this. It's taken me a long time to learn this. So I'm trying to do my best and obviously I have a lot of room to improve, but I'm never about trying to make perfect videos. I'm just trying to keep getting better every week. And so for this week, the advantage we're going to go over is my last advantage that I've had for obviously forever. It's the advantage of family. And it's something that this weekend applies specifically to me. So as I'm kind of going through the day, I'm going to probably try and capture some moments where you can kind of see that, you know, why it's my advantage and, you know, that I'm just so blessed. And it's one of the things that drive me to be healthier and push myself to be better, you know, to just be a better role model, be a better dad, husband. I'm always trying to push myself to be better. And this is just one of those areas that just naturally do that for me because, you know, I want to be a better contributor to this household and, you know, to my family. So with that said, that's kind of the reason I don't have a hat on right now because my hair is so long now that now I have a decision to make. And I had one in mind going forward with the X-Form and unfortunately I couldn't make up my mind and I think my family wants to make that decision for me, which is fine. I just ask them that it be a drastic change. That's kind of where we're at there. So for right now, we're going to... Pop the hat back on because I'm more comfortable with a hat, especially because I don't like having long hair generally, but um, I kind of don't know what to do with it. So this is just easier for me and it's also going to play a role, let's say, in the next series. So one quick, say, question I have, and this is maybe you can or can't answer, is what would you do if it was your last day? Period. And that's kind of what it's going to be like for me today, just because knowing of going this lifestyle balance and something I've really enjoyed and flexibility, I'm going to be going a very strict version, a very different person just in order to shoot the Q form series. But so it's something that I'm kind of, let's say nervous to do, but I will say that today is gonna reflect a lot of what I kind of would do is I would spend time with my family, still kind of keep things, you know, sort of structured and just kind of live it out the best I could. And it's one of those things we don't always know our, you know, our days end. So what I'm gonna do today for sure is just capture some of the moments, you know, kind of what's what I'm going through, you know, enjoying that balance, just kind of showing you, you know, that overall that I'm very happy in this process. It's not something that I'm just doing for camera. It's something that I, I actually have more joy off the camera because there's no stress of filming it. So I'd like to just capture a few things today and that way you can kind of see that and really wrap this series up with what I think is kind of appropriate is just, you know, just showing my best self and showing what I've enjoyed most and a little bit of the moments, you know, that kind of keep me going and strive to do better in life. But ultimately, I, as soon as tomorrow starts, it's going to be grinding. So and you'll get to see that if you follow me in the Q form series. So with that said, let's go ahead and get moving on our day. We got to go. We got to get moving to the gym. So it's about to get I'm about to get started.